hello there, my name is Thomas. Uh, you might know me from my blog that I'm making, my Lego projects. Apologies for any stutters or stops. Uh, this is my first video, actually. Um, and I'll be making a windmill. So I should have a picture on my post. And this will be the construction video. So first you start with this piece. Oh, you start with this piece. It's a two by two circular donut piece, as I like to call it. And you put that in the middle there. So not in the middle, but middle right. Then you have this dark tan piece and you put that opposite like that so you have four spaces in between then you have this regular tan piece and you put that on top of the dark tan piece so now you've got two two by two squares on top of each other then you have this piece and this will be your hay bales i guess beh behind the farm uh, and then you'll need three of these tile pieces for the roof. One, two, three. So this will be uh, like a roof in an L formation. Now you'll need these two light grey studs. And you put them in that gap that you made. And then you have this white one by one square and put that on top. So that would be your smoke. Ooh. Next you have these two grey cylinders and those will go beside the house. So it would look like that. And then you have this river. So to make this river you'll have, you will need, not have, or you might have, I don't know, you will need two siren pieces, or they might be different in other sets. Uh, if you don't have these translucent blue pieces, uh, just regular blue or light blue could do as, just as well. So you put the that piece here and clip that on. Then you have this other piece and you make sure that it doesn't sort of overlaps it so then you have three spaces to the end of it and then on the last bit you'll need this translucent blue stud piece and you just put that there so now you have a river now the windmill the windmill does have some reverse building so you'll have you will need four cylinders and you put one of those cylinders in that donut piece you placed earlier and then you have a rod I don't know if you can see that on camera but it's it's like a pole I guess longer than regular poles with a little like a thing here then you put the shortest end into the into the cylinder so then it sticks doesn't fall out and then you thread these three other cylinders on, like so. Now, this bit is some more reverse building. So instead of placing the piece like this, you'll need to place it through the lantern hole there. Oh, whoops. There. And you just push that through and turn it. So then you, it's facing the way... I'm looking at it right now. So it's facing away from the river. Next you'll need this white cone piece to put on the back. So that will make the back of your windmill. And then you'll need a blue pin piece, half pin. And you put that on the on that bit. So now you can see where the windmill's coming from. And then you have a black Technic propeller piece. And there you go, your windmill is complete. Now, if you want to add more detail, uh, I will, 
uh, I have two tan one by one squares and those will be my hay bales uh, you can add animals if you want so those could be white studs like that like I used for the chimney and those could be sheep or you could have um, black ones for black sheep uh, and pink ones for pigs uh, so yes this is this is my mini build for today I will be back soon